We're going to test it just like we do any other test. So, we are going to measure his initial energy field right over here, based on where you're standing, the effects of the room, the lights you're under. So this is your baseline. Okay, so as soon as you receive, okay, that little brown painting, again, there's energy, interesting. First time I've seen this off a painting. Now that energy from the painting is synchronizing with you, okay? See, it kind of has a calming effect, okay? I feel calm. You do. You feel calm, yeah, exactly. So now you've synchronized with that energy, and this allows me to go back. So the camera is going to catch. I'm way out here. So change that to the other picture. And this one is now embedded with gemstones and other energies. And once again, the effects of it, it raises the vibration and you see the spinning effects of the wands. And now it's slowing down. Once again, it's calming. But it's going now actually into a phase two of where it's spinning. So it seems to work deeper. So where a deeper work needs to be done, perhaps someone with a crisis would benefit from this because there's a lot of deep work that needs to be done. So this can work at many different levels. Watch now what happens. Slowing down. So it's creating a calming effect on the person. And now, the energy field goes up. Beautiful. Well done, Candace, in your designs, your intentions to be able to help people. So it's, again, it's all about that. Just remember that each one of us were meant to create. So do your art and do it with the intention to help elevate everyone else around there. Thank you, Candace, and thank you all for watching this. Share this information, make any comments, questions, or visit Candace's website. Thank you.